A Fall River appliance store has abruptly shut its doors for good. A sign on the door of Nate Lyons reads, out of business. The sudden closure leaving customers waiting for deliveries they may never receive. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen has the details on what a frustrated customer is saying tonight. Steve? Oh well, yeah, Mike, without hearing from the store's owner, it's tough to know if these customers will ever get the appliances they purchased. But the ones I talked with today are already moving on, assuming they're out of luck and money. Right off 195 in Fall River, Nate Lyons Appliance World has a new sign out front. Out of business. It was a stunning announcement to Tim Walsh. It just seems like, you know, why would you take people's money if you know you're going out of business? According to his receipt, he paid the company $488 last week. Uh, it's a $500 refrigerator. Uh, our old one broke, so. And you paid in full? Yep, in cash. But now he says the fridge isn't coming. We've repeatedly reached out to Nate Lyons. We've called their phone, searched business records, but no one has returned our calls. Just a simple sign saying they're closed. Another shopper showed me her receipt for more than $3,000 for all new kitchen appliances. It's stamped paid. Now she says she's out of luck. Always go to Nate Lyons because that's where we've always gone. Uh, my grandparents, my mother, everyone has gone to Nate Lyons. So we went down there. You trusted them? Yeah, absolutely. Walsh said he hopes he gets his money back. I'm not holding my breath. Now, again, I want to stress, we have tried to get in touch with the business, but we haven't been able to. Tim and several other customers I talked with said they have filed complaints with the Attorney General's office. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.